Alright, hi. I'm trying not to talk so loud because it's actually people home. Um, so it's a time of year just to have an excuse to spend money, and if you don't buy people things or spend enough money on people, you apparently don't care for them enough. Anyway, that aside, this is another product review. Like I said, I was going to do a few of these. Um, this is for Sephora's um, All Aglow. Just such a weird thing to say. All ago, all ago, all ago, uh, face palette. Yeah, it's actually pretty small. It's about the size of my phone, you know. Let's see it better. There we go. Yeah. There we are. You see all, like, the stuff you get. Um, so yeah, here you have, like, cream concealers. And you got some bronzers. You got some powder blushes, some cream blushes, and a bunch of different highlighters. These three bronzers look the same. Like, if you want to take it, oh god. Like, my lighting is actually giving them, my lighting is actually making all three of these different. It's actually not. <laughs> it's actually, this is like a lightish pink color. This is kind of tannish pink. This is slightly dark, dark tannish pink. There's not much difference with these. Barely see it on my pale skin. Like, it's not really coming off. So, this is just a thing. <laughs> I just slap it on my head. Oh, you can't see that. That's the, uh, I guess you would say medium one. Oh god. What? You can't fucking see that. Let's try that again. No? Yes? No? Oh, oh! You see the light reflecting. And then, I guess you would call it a dark shade, but it's not even dark. Because there are people actually are darker than this. There you go. Now you can see it. Yeah. The blushes are nice. Ink. Oh, you can't see it. It looks like Barbie's, oops. It's like Barbie's shoe. And... Then I'm going to take, what is this, the goldy color, oh, 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 how do mirrors work, yeah, mm, it's kind of reflective, mm -hmm. I'm just going to have swatches of color on me, my parents go, oh, eh, eh. it's actually a Grumbacher watercolor brush, because you can just spend like two to three dollars on a on a regular paintbrush, you don't need to spend twenty five dollars, you really need to, under some people need to understand that. It doesn't make you less of a makeup artist, anyway. So let's do this side. This is the powder. This is the, as you see, the Nicki Minaj shoe. Um, and this is the, whoa, how do things work? That's a lighter pink. You can't see shit. This is the rosy color. Oh my god, I don't know. Sorry, I have no idea how my camera works. And then, okay. <laughs> and this is more of a, like, uh, right there. You kind of see it. Like I'm, I'm really pale. So the the, cr the creams are actually better than the powders. Watercolor brush. <laughs> I think technically acrylic, but water. I use, I use watercolor brushes on oils. But that's not the point. I'm using this highlighter one. Just gonna put on my chin. Hmm. Let's put that there. My eyebrow. Ooh, look at that. Yes. And then this is a goldy color. I'm just gonna put it right there on top of that. Oh, I can't tell. Oh, you can see, you kind of see it reflecting. Yeah. Now I'm going to take the cream one and just put it over that eyebrow. And you can kind of see it reflecting. And then take the pink one. I'm just going to put it right on the T-zone. Just make the T-zone look really good. And then I'm just take this yellowy golden one. Just tip of my nose. Just, just to show the boys that i got tons of acne. Oh, yeah. Oh, my nose is shining. Yeah. <laughs> Look like I have no idea how makeup works. <laughs> oh my god. Oh dear. Okay, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, th this I I bought it mainly because it's small and it's it's a good like travel thing to have. This is um $34. It's valued at $90, which I'm, makes sense because there's so much product. Before I bought it, I saw like a couple of reviews, you know, just pretty much talking about how small it is, but on the website the itself it even it gives you the measurements so your ass probably should have taken your tape measure or your ruler and measured it they were like oh my god it's like the size of my phone i'm like yes yes it is it's the size of a fucking phone like the whole point is that like sorry they didn't you know label that it's travel size or something because you can't think for yourself it's something small just like just to have on hand you know because usually palettes i have are like this big Again, I don't know if I'm going to do any more product reviews. This feels awkward. <laughs> Just used to yelling about movies and continuity. But, alright. Uh, awkward wave. New painting. Oil paints. <laughs> <laughs>
See, that's how you do yours. I have a dirty plate. <laughs> Camera better. Yeah, so the bullets here are actually, if you look inside, they're actually kind of riveted into the straps themselves. It's, 